Everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm Ms. Ruxanon, and this is Daily Rambles. I just want to apologize for the last video. Felicity has been in the episode since the one gummin. I'm very sorry. I don't know what in the world I was thinking. I've been a little sleep deprived. Just a little bit. So anyway, today we're talking about Arrow, and today we're talking about the episode 7, I believe. And this is Muse on Fire. Um, it's kind of like a, a I feel like a filler type episode, but we're just going to go through it kind of quick. I hope this is not... Okay, anyway. So we start off the scene with Oliver on a motorcycle. And he's going to meet his mother for lunch. And someone on another motorcycle um, sh uh, shoots um, at this guy with Moira right there. Like literally right behind him. And so she gets okay, uh, she gets knocked down to the ground. So Oliver asks if she's okay. Then Oliver goes after the, the person on the motorcycle, but they got away. And then um, Mora is in the hospital and turns out she's got a concussion from it. So they um, got to take really good care of her. Like she can go home, but she has to have care because she's concussed. I think they said stage two. Anyway. Uh, Thea is pissed at Oliver because he didn't stay with her and try to go after the people, the person on the motorcycle. So then we cut to dinner at Laurel's with Tommy and ask Laurel out. She's kind of, eh, I don't know yet. And then we find out the gunman is actually a gun girl. So it's a girl who shot at people. And then we cut to Tommy telling Oliver about Laurel. And um, he's like, that's fine. But if you do anything, I'll break your neck. <laughs> Kidding. Okay. <laughs> and I think this is when they said it. Because I think they were trying to say it earlier. And I was just like, he didn't really say that. Because I remember him saying that in, that in the episode. In season one, I just couldn't remember which episode. Anyway, I believe it is. Then Mora and Thea have a heart to heart. And then Oliver has a meeting with Bertinelli, which and then um, Frank Bertinelli um, has a important meeting to go to. So his daughter Helena uh, um, takes Oliver to dinner. And then we cut to Tommy and Oliver having dinner, but his card gets declined. And the guy says, like, the card needs to be concept, 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 confiscated. Okay, I finally got that word out. <laughs> to me a sec. So um, then we cut to Merlin, talk some more about shady stuff. And then as the dinner wraps up, Oliver's on the phone with Diggle. And said there's a about, it's about to go down at Rus Russo's. So that's where he's literally at. So then um, they get into a, there's a fight there and between the gun, um, between Helena and Arrow and the Bertinelli mob people. Then Oliver punches, um, punches the, the, what is it? Oh, I got mad at my what? And so he punches the helmet visor and takes off the helmet and realizes it's Helena is the gunwoman and then they all disappear and then we cut to Lance reviewing footage about um, from the place and then um, he warns Oliver about Helena. So there's that. And then uh, Tommy confronts Merlin and Merlin says you're cut off. Bye. You're a loser. Get out of my sight. Bye. I was like, oh, shoot. And uh, you'll say Tommy is not happy whatsoever. So there's that. Then Oliver talks to Helena. And Helena and Ollie get kidnapped by Nick, which is um, Frank Bernelli's, uh 
bodyguard. I think head of security. It's like family. It's uh, it's hard. For me. I can't really remember. And it turns out Helena was setting up her family and not her dead fiance who got killed by Nick. So when she finds that out, she goes all kind of crazy, and there's a huge, really good fight scene. And then um, they kill everybody, basically. Helena and Oliver kill everybody. <laughs> and then uh, Tommy shows up at Laurel's and tells her he got cut off. And then, so Laurel lets him in the apartment. And then Walter is back. Yay, Walter! And then Thea apologizes to Oliver. And then, um, and basically says, but you gotta open up. You just, you gotta start opening up. So he decides to, um, uh, show up at Helena's house and, um, opens up. Saying, like, oh, I'm the arrow. And then, but she kind of already knew that. So, they make out, and that's that. That's the end of that episode. Uh, I'll probably give this, uh, I don't know, I'll give this like a B. I mean, there was some, I mean, it was a filler episode. I mean, it was a good episode, but it's kind of filler. So, it wasn't too horrible. They just could have, I don't know, done a little bit more, just a little bit more. But this is like the beginning season, so I'm not going to put too much weight on that, so, it was a really good episode, I really did like it, um, I know I'll bump it up to an A, so it's an A, but not A+, plus. but it was filler, uh, they could have done a lot more stuff out, um, the scenes were great, the synchronization was great, so I really did appreciate that, and the storyline was really good as well, so, oh no, really good episode, so, uh, I'm going to finish this another 8 minutes. What? That's awesome. So if you like this video, give it a like or a dislike. Tell me how I'm doing in the comment section down below and just comment there what want you want to see next. Because I know you want to see some more stuff. And, and subscribe for more awesomeness for me. Because I will get better. I'm already, I already tell you I am getting better. But I just want to see how everything's going to go. So anyway. That's one do for me. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on my next video.